it's Lee from ColouringQueen.net and I've got a new Alice in Wonderland colouring book for you. Slightly different layout on this one. They've elected to have the pictures portrait style, which is fine, but they're double scenes. So it means that flipping through this is going to be a little bit difficult. So you'll see what I mean in a minute. So we've got plain title page. Paper is medium quality and it's very nice. It's nice and white and smooth. It's just this format that they've gone with with um, the portrait style, but it's vertical, not horizontal like we're used to. So it's going to take a bit of getting used to. We've got the top half of the picture there and then the bottom half. And unfortunately I can't show you the full thing is vertical because I'd have to move the camera so far away that you wouldn't be able to see the detail. The liner on it's a dull black and it's kind of like a sketchy hand-drawn appearance on it. Now when I ordered this I was sort of taking a bit of a punt because the description box had a really low count of pages in this book. And I thought it can't possibly be that thin. So I'd say it's just a mistake the way they've counted the pages if you see it online. It's folding over lovely and flat. I mean, it's not overly thick, this book, so it does fold down really well. We've got some gorgeous images in here, and it really is a rabbit hole that this Alice has fallen into with you know, jungle animals and whatnot. A completely different Alice. From what you might expect. We've even got some ocean scenes here. And some great buildings in this one. I always think buildings are great to do if you're just starting out or if you're not feeling very confident. We've got a ton of hats in this one. And even a lovely little carousel horse. And then thump thump, she's at the end of this giant rabbit hole. Little page at the end. 
and the back cover. So this Alice fell through a really weird rabbit hole and it's great to see these different versions of Alice in Wonderland. Until next time, happy colouring.